Today we're going to talk about the Pulmonetix LTV 1000 ventilator. This is a small transport ventilator that can be used long term or short term. It's about the size of a large laptop and does a very nice job with basic ventilation of your patient. First off, you will need to use a special Pulmonetix circuit You can't just use any circuit with the Pulmonetix ventilator. Now, inside the packaging insert is this diagram which will show you how this is to be set up on the patient. Briefly, the circuit comes pre-assembled. You have the Y and you have the flow sensors two sensor lines and inside there is a small wedge that allows the machine to sense both tidal volume and pressures. The opposite end you have two, two lure fittings, a large bore fitting and a pressure line. These lure fittings will go into the side of the ventilator, which I'll show in a few seconds. Now, this long tubing, which starts here and goes all the way to the Y, is the inspiratory side. Now, at the end of the expiratory side is this exhalation valve. This exhalation valve also acts as our PEEP device. By pressing in the yellow portion here, we can rotate this cap and create a level of PEEP which is embedded or engraved on the inner column of the, the valve. So as we want PEEP, we simply rotate this until the line crosses that portion on the column. And then we double check the pressure by looking at the readout on the pulmonetic ventilator. Let's take a close-up look on this ventilator. On the side panel of the uh, ventilator and you can see that we have a couple of connections. One here is the outlet from the ventilator and this is your inspiratory outlet. Then you have a pressure adapter and you have our uh, transducer lure fittings. Now, we're going to uh, fit the tubing, large bore, onto that and we're going to take our pressure line onto the pressure nipple and then we're also going to uh, match these to the lure fittings. Note, one is a female fitting and one is a male fitting and they just screw on to the uh, appropriate one. And if you're not sure, white, yellow, and then the uh, peep valve or the uh, pressure line. Okay, now we have our circuit and we can use a humidifier with this but in this case we're going to use an HME. We're going to attach that and then simply connect it to our patient. Okay.